Roll call, 219 here. And I just did a little black shop, Black Friday shopping, or whatever you want to call this day. Uh, so, I don't really like to do it. I think people are rude, ignorant, uh, and then everybody freaks out. So, I don't like to go in the mornings. And despite my not going in the mornings, I did miss out on a lot of good stuff. But, I mean, what can you do? Uh, Thanksgiving was last night. Happy Thanksgiving to you guys. And, uh, or happy late Thanksgiving. <laughs> but anyways, uh, so I got up late. We had uh, games down here and we were having fun. And, you know, I w woke up at 6 in the morning and looked around and just decided not to go. Because I was tired and had a little bit of a hangover. So, I'll go over some of the stuff that I missed. And I missed a lot. Because of festivities, family, eating, and all the good stuff that comes with Thanksgiving. So, at my local store, uh, they had really good deals at this store. It's, uh, it's a three-day sale, though. But most of the stuff that was uh, the Black Friday sale, most of that stuff is gone. So whatever's left is going to be uh, crumbs. But they did have a pair of Walthers on sale, the Walther Creed 9mm. That was two sixty nine ninety nine. You save a hundred bucks. Uh, the PPK twenty two long rifle was two forty nine. Uh, Smith & Wesson SD9VE 9mm was $299.99. Uh, Ruger LC9S uh, with the crimson, crimson Trace Laser was $399.99. And then you had a uh, car. There was a three, the 380 car. That was on sale for $239.99. And then the Taurus T TCP 380, the, the little mouse gun that I bought, that was on sale. That was almost the best deal. And that was $169.99. And they still had a few of those left, but I already got one. So I don't need that gun. But those were uh, the majority of handguns that were the, the Black Friday sale. So uh, uh, they did have Sky CPX. Let me see, what is that? The Sky CPX-2, uh, nine, the 9mm nine handgun. And if you bought one of those, you got a free magazine. So, <laughs> Travis P11, uh, if you watch my channel, go to Big R, uh, buy another Sky, and you get another magazine to help you with your magazine issues with that gun. I uh, got rid of mine, so I don't have to deal with that. My dog's down here doing whatever a dog does but anyways that was another good deal uh i did buy let's see what we got i did buy some smb some nine millimeter oh here he is some nine millimeter that was 8.99 a box i told you nine millimeter right now in my area is cheap and this is an example of it this was 8.99 a box picked up a box i got about five six hundred rounds of nine millimeter left in there so i don't i i didn't really want to buy a bunch of nine millimeter a lot of people were buying four or five boxes at a time there was no limit uh you couldn't get rain checks on this stuff uh everything was quantity on hand they did have uh anderson strip lower for 39.99 which isn't bad um what else did they have they do have a arms core armory uh M14 Youth uh, 22 Long Rifle for $89.99. Now, I was going to buy that for my son because it was $109.99 and then it dropped to uh, $89.99. And then I missed that sale, but it went back on sale for $89.99. Since it's a three-day sale, I'll probably go back and get that gun for him. Uh, the, the main thing I wanted to go and get was the Sa the Savage Stevens 
320, uh, 12-gauge pump-action shotgun, $149.99. And when I got there, out of stock. So I missed that one. That was another good uh, deal. They had good de deals on safes. Uh, a Kodiak uh, $749.99. And that was uh, the, the bigger one. Uh, they had a big horn safe for $79.99. And another smaller Kodiak safe for $479.99. Uh, I did buy these little ammo cans. These were like a buck. So that's a that's a, that was a good deal. Uh, they had Red Rider BB guns, some boots. Yeti coolers came down a little bit. They're, they were still in the $300 range, so I didn't buy one of those. Uh, they had Allen 46 inch uh, Durango scope gun case there for $5.99. That was another good deal. So they had quite a, quite a few deals at this at the store today. Uh, I I just missed out on on like I said this this the shotgun. I missed that. Uh, I didn't really want to buy any of these handguns. Uh, I don't know. They just seemed plain to me. And there wasn't there wasn't uh, a whole lot of them left. I think there was the, there was a car, 380 there. The Taurus 380 was there, and then that little 22 uh, uh, long rifle that was there. And Sky they had a bunch of Sky CPX twos there, and it looked like nobody was going to buy those, even as they offered a free magazine <laughs> with it. Uh, so, I mean, there was some good deals today. I didn't get out to that many places. I just, Black Friday to me is something that I'm just not interested in. Uh, yeah, you, you like, like I just explained on all these deals, yeah, you do find some deals. But, I mean, just the hassle going in there. The gun counter, when I went in there, was just packed with people um, and one dude was working the counter so it was just taking forever just to look at the guns because i wanted to really look at that car 380 because i think the car 380 is a, a pretty nice gun but i mean i'd have to wait there for hours just to look at stuff but uh that was the majority of good stuff at this store I, I if you if you don't follow me on Twitter, you can follow me at uh, Roll Call Twenty Ten. Uh, that's that's my Twitter handle. I did uh, tweet out some other deals that were around my area. They had the big buckets of Remington, the, the little buckets of Remington, three hundred and fifty rounds for thirty nine ninety nine at at Dunham's, and then there were forty nine ninety nine in some places, but those. Little buckets of nine millimeters, though they were everywhere. Uh, they didn't have any at this particular store, they were all sold out. But I bet you I could go to Dunham's if I really wanted another 350 rounds of nine millimeter. Like I said, that stuff is dirt cheap right now. If you live in my area and you own a nine millimeter or you think about buying one, this is the greatest time to go and buy a handgun because some of these handguns are really cheap. And they are chambered in 9mm. Uh, if you want to you know, take a risk and buy a Sky CPX 2, uh, do it. I, I've heard, you know, I've, I've experienced mine and I didn't like it. I had problems with it. But I've seen other people that have not had problems with that gun. Uh, I think they're still learning on uh, the manufacturing of a good firearm. Uh, I will never say i won't purchase another firearm from sky industries uh the customer service is great but like i said nine millimeter is cheap right now and you can get a sky cpx2 for a hundred 200 bucks 199.99 plus you get a free magazine and i believe that gun does come with two magazines when you buy it so you'll have three magazines and then you can shoot uh eight dollars uh worth of ammo so that's that's a really good deal and then you can keep your ammunition in these little cases that were a buck so that's that's pretty good deals that were going on today 
Uh, like I said, man, I just didn't want to get out of bed. I just didn't feel feel the need to go out there and struggle to find parking to, you know, come back. You know, people that were acting like morons. I did, like I said, I did today go later in the day, and it was like picking up crumbs. So I did find a couple good deals today. Not a whole lot. I really wish I would have got this this Stevens uh, 12 gauge pump for $149.99, but that probably was the first thing to go out of stock. I think that's one of the things I don't like about Black Friday. When they put something there for $149 or whatnot, uh, I think that's the problem because they only get like four of them or five of them, and that's it. So, you know, just to get you into that store, if you're going to have a good sale like that, at least have, you know, a, a dozen or two dozen of, of these guns, you know, because that's basically why I wanted to go there is to buy that shotgun. But unfortunately, I didn't, I didn't want to get out of bed. I didn't want to wait in the line and I didn't want to have to deal with people basically. But, yeah, just go follow me on Twitter, Roll Call 2010 I've been on Twitter for longer than I have been on uh, YouTube. So I tweeted out some more good deals in, some, uh, in, in my area. Maybe you can order this stuff online that I tweeted out there. So there is pretty good deals out there. So uh, that's what I, I kind of did today. I didn't go to a whole lot of places. Just didn't want to, there was a lot of traffic out there. I just wanted to get come home, sit here, and, you know, relax. But those were some of the deals that were out there today. Uh, this is a three-day sale over here at uh, Big R. Right here in Big R. So if you have a Big R, go check it out. But on the bottom of their flyer, it says, Firearms not available at our Gibson City location. So if you look at Gip, if you're live in Gibson City, uh, wherever that is, uh, you're not gonna get a firearm because they don't sell them there for some reason. I don't know, but that was the deals there. Uh, I did go to Ace Hardware. They had a couple good deals. Picked up some odds and ends. Other than that, I don't really do Black Friday. I think sometimes it's just a waste, and I just don't like it. But Wish you guys all a happy Thanksgiving. Hope it was fantastic for you. Spent time with friends, family, and all the loved ones in your life. And I'd like to thank my old and new subscribers and just the people that zipped through my channel. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, like the videos, comment below. Uh, hit that little bell if you want some more content. And like always, I'll catch you on the next one.